Greetings, you filthy organic meat bags. It is I, HK47. And today, I shall show you how to use the voice editing software programs Audacity and Goldwave to transform your pathetic, annoying organic voices into the monotone robotic one which is my own. Assessment. You have been exceedingly sporting during our hunt. I am HK-47, the Master's most faithful ally. Once a mere assassin droid, it is now my burden and joy to command the Foundry's mechanical armies. I didn't think Jedi believed in assassination. Or built droids to do their dirty work. Commentary. I am often pleasantly surprised by my master's moral compass. The extermination droids are my master's crowning achievement. They are equipped with bioscanners capable of detecting Sith genetic material. Any organics with Sith ancestry will be slaughtered. This includes 97.8% of the Imperial population. This was never about winning the war. You're talking about genocide. Emphasis. 97.8% efficient genocide. Come there. As much as I'm looking forward to butchering our enemies planet by planet, I have missed the personal touch. Your bones will make excellent trophies to commemorate my return to assassination. Hello everyone, it's me Darth Vigorous, and as you saw by the intro today, I'll be showing you how to make your voice sound like HK-47 or HK Droid from the Star Wars Knights of the Republic video games and the now almost decade old um, online game Star Wars The Old Republic. So, to start off his robotic voice, you need to make an impression that sounds close to HK-47, like that and record it, which I've already done here in Audacity. Um, so, first thing you want to do is, of course, um, click the um, area of the track that's not um, part of what you're trying to record. Go to Effect, Noise Reduction, Get Noise Profile. Then, um, hit Control a to select the entire track, or you can just click in this area here. And go to Effect, Noise Reduction again, this time click OK, then delete this bit of track that has nothing to do with your recording. Then to clear up the audio, what I do is go to Compressor, have it these settings here, give it a few seconds, click OK, and we'll go to Equalization, OK, go to Unnamed. Give it a few seconds here to see, um, I have the line set up here, so at 100 hertz, at 9 decibels. Then 1000 hertz, at 0 decibels. Click OK. Go to Effect. Go to Equalization. Then go to Bass Boost. Click OK. And go to Effect. Equalization. Go to Trouble Boost, click OK. Then we'll go to Effect, Equalization, uh, oops, sorry. Gonna go to Effect, Normalize, click OK. And this is where our audio will sound like once we've cleared it up. Statement. Oh yes, Master. Pain is really the only reliable means by which truth may be obtained. Or so I choose to believe. Now to get, do the voice filter effect to really sound like HK, we'll now be going into the program uh, Gold Wave, which I downloaded. Um, I'll may put a link to it in there so you guys know where to get it. And see you guys in a bit. Okay, everybody, this is Darth Vigris, and we're now in Gold Wave. Um, I forgot to show us once you're on Audacity after you did what we just did. Um, I exported the audio as an MP3 file, so now once you open up Gold Wave, you go to Open. Uh, Click open here. Let's see. Then let's see. I saved it as rough tutorial HK47. 
Now, to f do the voice filter effect, once we are here in Gold Wave, we just have to go to Effect, go to Filter, Select, Band Pass, Stop. And it's really simple. So up here in Initial Frequency Range, we have to change from to 400 and to to 4000. Click OK. And here is the final result. Statement. Oh yes, master. Pain is really the only reliable means by which truth may be obtained. Or so I choose to believe. And that is how you use Audacity and Gold Wave to sound like HK47 from Star Wars. Again, I'm Darth Vigris. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe, like, comment, and enjoy the rest of your day. Every other night